There are 60 galaxies known to orbit around the Milky Way, but many of them are quite dim. So dim, in fact, they were originally thought to be a fingerprint on the photographic plate on which they were taken. They're called dwarf spheroidals, and they have sort of a love-hate relationship with our galaxy. A new study from researchers at Tohoku University in Japan has found that these faint galaxies were once flush with young stars, initially illuminating when they crossed paths with our galaxy and entered the Milky Way's gravity field. But then, as the Milky Way passed by, the budding galaxies stopped producing new stars and were left to burn out. So why were these potential galaxies more or less snuffed out? Well, the researchers say as the Milky Way approached, it caused the gas within the new galaxies to collapse, which spawned lots of new stars. But as the Milky Way moved away, the gravity caused by its mass was so great, it pulled with it all of the gases and other materials needed for new star formation, meaning the Milky Way both giveth and taketh away.